arrive on Kyrgyzstan? Why did you come here? Kyrgyzstan is a beautiful country. I've been to many countries and uh, the people are very nice and the nature is very beautiful. And I visited this as a tourist. I felt uh, there's a lot I can share in this country because I'm a landscape photographer. And I decided to come and uh, give a few lectures in the universities in Kyrgyzstan in Bishkek. When I was very young, I think about 18 or 19 years old, and uh, I made money uh, by selling my pictures. And uh, I still sell my pictures, and uh, they're bought all over the world, uh, through the internet, through exhibitions, and also my publications and books. And that's one of the sources of uh, income that I have. And a lot of it I uh, donate in charity. Mm -hmm. Yes, I do have uh, quite a few of them. And uh, uh, some of them are from uh, uh, Ukraine. Some of them are from uh, England. And uh, some of them are from Switzerland. Uh, but they have been on various occasions over this last 20 years that I've been photographing. Да, конечно, и страны. countries your photography causes a lot of kind of success. Uh, I think United States of America, it's uh, quite successful because there are some beautiful landscapes on the western part of United States, and also in uh, Ukraine, and uh, it's, it's, it's been quite successful there with the various photo clubs. And uh, I also teach in the Institute of Photojournalism in Kyiv. So photography is a very creative profession, so what is most important for you? Making money on, on selling your photographs or your creativity and possibility to realize yourself? Uh, I think it's the creativity. I mean, that's the soul. And uh, it's, it's a beautiful feeling when you take good pictures and you can, it's even more beautiful when you can share them with others. There's a lot of talent in your country among your students. And uh, I, I felt that I must open the windows and doors for them in their mind to be able to, uh, you know, to, to be able to use this potential of this talent that they have towards photography. Do you have any other hobbies and passions? Uh, well, the only other passion that I have other than photography is uh, uh, actually Traveling. I love to travel, visit various countries, see different cultures, meet different people, see their food, and also to understand the history as we were taught in our books and to actually stand there and see it. So photography is the creativity, so sometimes all your uh, photographs are perceived uh, positively, sometimes negatively. Did you have any experience when your works were perceived negatively? Uh, you mean when I'm not happy with my work? Not only you happy, but people who will, who look at your photos are not happy about them. Uh, that really never has happened because uh, most of the time I'm showing them different parts of the world and they're very, very intrigued and very excited to see the landscapes of different parts of the world. So I never had any negative uh, approach on that. Uh, they're very friendly and they like to see different parts of the world especially the landscape and wildlife. You know, there was never any negative experience in my relationships with my viewers. The fact is that I travel a lot around the world, and my photos are photographed in very different places. When I show the nature in one part of the world, on a different side of the world, on a different continent, the only thing I see is this surprise, this intrigue, this awe of the fact that they have the opportunity to see something else. So it's very difficult to say that when we were working inadequately. And the main recipe, how to find yourself? The recipe, how to be happy, how to realize yourself and how to make money. Well, the first thing is to listen to yourself. I think that's most important. You should know what you want to do and what makes you happy. And once you know that, uh, you just go trying to pursue that. And the best thing, which is more important than money, is to be happy.